I'm going to show you how you can buy tokens before they get listed in centralized exchanges such as Binance or KuCoin and do this safely without any risk and we are starting right now. If you are interested in a project that just launched a token and you are looking to buy that token and when you search for that token in Binance or all centralized exchanges you don't find it, usually that project launched the token in decentralized exchanges first and then they go from decentralized exchanges to centralized exchanges. So how to buy these tokens from decentralized exchanges? First we gotta understand that there is different blockchains, Ethereum for example or Binance Smart Chain or Polygon or many other blockchains. So first you gotta know in which blockchain that token exists. So let me show you how to know in which blockchain that's, that token exists and show you how you can buy it easily and with no problems. First let's pick a token um, randomly. Let's uh, go to recently added tokens. Let's choose for example this one, Medical Universe. As we can see here it's in the BNB Smart Chain. So this is the address of the token. So in this case uh, we are going to we are going first to, to copy this address just like this and go straight down here and see in which markets the token exists. So uh, this token exists for example in PancakeSwap uh, which is a decentralized exchange. So uh, we go to PancakeSwap, just click here, we go to PancakeSwap and we gotta connect our wallet. Uh, in this case my wallet is already connected. I'm going to disconnect my wallet so I can show you how we can do it. Alright, I disconnected my wallet. So uh, if you have PNB in your wallet, uh, you are going to swap PNB for this this token. And if you are if you have uh, Ether, if you have USDT for example in your wallet, you are going to swap USDT for this token. So in my case, I'm going to use BNB for example. Uh, here I'm I'm looking to swap PNB for this token, which is Merkle Universe. I'm going to click here, and uh, here I'm going to pass the address just like this. Okay, um, the, here is the token. I'm going to click on import. Uh, please read this disclaimer and uh, make sure you uh, you invest or you buy the token that you are really looking to buy because there are many scammers out there and click on understand all right click on import and now you can swap bnb for this token uh, which is medical universe in order to do this you are going to to have to connect your wallet uh in my case i'm, I'm using metamask i'm just going to click on connect wallet choose metamask all right, uh, my MetaMask gets connected. I'm uh, I'm going to import this token in my MetaMask. So when I buy my token from PancakeSwap, I'm going to see it on my MetaMask. It's super easy to do. You just have to save that address we copied from CoinMarketCap and click on Import Tokens. Here we are going to pass the, the, the address, the token address, and here we click on Add Custom Token. Also, make sure you are working on the Binance Smart Chain because there are many many chains out there. In, in my wallet, I have Polygon and Ethereum Mainnet. So choose the Binance Smart Chain. Why? Because basically the token is in the BNB Smart Chain. Add Custom Token and Import Token. And here we have our token. So basically, once we buy, in this case, I don't have BNB in this wallet, so uh, I'm not going to do the transaction, but it's super easy. You're just going to have to click here uh, how much amount of BNB are looking to swap for this token. Yeah, for example, let's say 1 BNB. 1 BNB is going to give you this number of this token. And you are going to click here. In my case, I don't have I don't have balance on B, uh, of BNB. In your case, you are just going to click on swap, and you are going to click OK, OK, OK. Here, they are going to, to, to let you confirm that you are the one who's trying to make this transaction. And... Boom, you have your token on your on your wallet. So it's super easy. So in this case, it was a token in the smart chain. So we are going to pick another case of a token that exists in the in the Ethereum blo blockchain, for example. Sandbox already exists on centralized exchanges. I'm just going to pick it as an example. So you just copy your address right here and go down and see in which decentralized exchange exists. Um, it's usually going to be on Uniswap. All right, all right, oh, here is on Uniswap. You just click here, it will take you to the official website and always make sure that this is the official website, app.uniswap.org. You are just going to here to select the token. Just pass the address right here and click right here. And here on the token that you are looking to give to get sandbox. In my case, I'm going to pick, for example, Ethereum or USDT. Let's pick USDT. You just have here to connect your wallet, same as Binance Smart Chain. Uh, you, I'm just going to click on connect my wallet. I'm going to choose MetaMask. Here I'm going to, to enter my password. And here they are uh, they, they are saying that in which account you are looking to uh, to, to make this transaction. Um, this all right. Let's click on uh, account number one. Click on next. Already connected. 
okay uh, they said here that's the this is our own network so as i mentioned before you need to change the network depends on the blockchain in this case we are working on the ethereum blockchain so i'm going to change it to, to ethereum blockchain okay let's click on metamask right here and click on ethereum mainnet All right, uh, now I can I can do this transaction super easy. I'm going to uh, to, to to give you SDT and get and get, uh, unit and get sandbox. You just enter the amounts of your SDT that are looking to swap for sandbox, and you are going to this is the, the equal amount of sandbox, and you are just going to do uh, here confirm transaction and click on OK to confirm the transaction, and that's it. So this is a disclaimer that you always need to make sure that you are buying the token of the right project because you know this is blockchain and everybody can create a token even if a token name already exists. For example, if um, the, this project is called Sandbox, I can or I can also create another token called Sandbox and uh, you know scam people. So always make sure that you are, you are buying the right projects. Also, in the Shish coins or in the, the the new coins recently added, you gotta always make sure that that the project is a scam by you know by reading their roadmap and uh, checking the community and what they are saying about the, about these projects also you have to check if it's a rug pool so you don't get scammed with liquid and liquidity or it's a honeypot so you can sell your token after you buy it because if it's a honeypot you cannot sell it and if you want to know more about how to know if a token is a scam or not please check the video they have made about Saitama and I'll show it step by step and how to know if a token is a scam or not and we took Saitama as an example so don't forget to check it please also when you are looking to swap or buy a token always leave a little bit of usdc for example or a little bit of, of ethereum of the token that you are going that you are looking to swap for another token on your wallet uh, so you pay the fees and the gas fees so that's it for today's video i hope you learned how to buy a token before you get lessons on centralized exchanges and please don't forget to subscribe like it will really help my channel and see you on the next video